one fifth du for dy. Which is putting du and factor the one fifth out. And since now we'll be integrating with respect to u, uh, we should change the limits to u. So if uh, y is equal to zero, so at the lower limit, uh, that means that u is equal to is also equal to zero. And if y is equal to the upper limit four, then u is equal to five times four, 20. So we want to integrate from u equals zero to uh, u equals 20. So this is one fifth times the fundamental theorem of calculus says that we find an antiderivative for this and evaluate it at the upper endpoint and subtract off um, its value at the lower end, evaluate, evaluated at the lower endpoint. So we did one fifth times uh, antiderivative for cosh is cinch. We get cinch of u evaluated from zero to twenty. This is equal to one fifth. Uh, cinch of 20 minus cinch of 0. Well, the cinch of 0 is just 0. And if we compute cinch of 20 uh, divided by 5, this is approximately equal to uh, a rather large number, uh, 48,000 or 48 million uh, 500 and 16,519.54.